Welcome to the MP4 Doggy Review of the um, the Fio E5 headphone amplifier. Um, as you know, we do have the E3 also in stock, and now we have the Fio E5. Um, we're trying to catch up with the big boys, but um, we do have the E5 now. So let's just do a quick review of it. Um, we actually love this thing. Um, we love the E3, but we love this one uh, probably even more just because they put more functionality into this one. It has a volume control. It has a power button. Um, although I, re I really wish they would have kind of made it kind of a cross between the E3 also where you just plug it in and it detects it and then you have to worry about the power being on. But it does have a built-in battery. Um, it has a charging five pin. It comes with a five pin um, USB uh, cable for charging, which is you know pretty standard. So you can get them you know pretty much anywhere. Um, it also comes with the uh, the connector that you're going to need because this will plug into your MP3 or MP4 player, and then this will plug into the E5, and then your headphones will actually plug into the very top of this, and then it has a clip where you can clip it to your shirt and you know wear it. Um, it's very stylish. It's got a metal metal body so it doesn't look it's definitely not a cheap looking device people are going to stop you and probably say you know what is that or where would you get that from because it's really nice um very you know black uh not very black but it's you know it's it's black it's a very nice design um so we're gonna um we have some speakers set up here and we have our handy dandy um onda vx777 le which we're going to use to hopefully uh test and we got and so let's see if you can hear the sound difference between you know with it and without it so let's go ahead and turn this on right now so we have the volume set at 20 on here and we're not going to change it on the unit itself or we're not going to touch the speakers at all so All right, so we're gonna go ahead and hook this up now. So the E5 is actually pretty small. It's about half the size of our of our 777 LE. Um, so this is a three inch screen, so maybe 1.5 inches. It's not that big at all. Um, we can uh, so as you can see, it's not that big. About an inch and a half. Uh, so one half by one half. It's not that big of a device. Um, but anyway, let's go ahead and um, so let's plug. And you're gonna plug this into the uh, input slot, and we're gonna plug this into the MP4 player, our handy dandy 777LE. Then we're going to plug our stereo ones at the here now the power's not on because like I said with the uh, with the e5s you have to actually turn the power on but it does have a self charging and that self charging has a charging has a built-in battery so there we go so now it's on so let's go ahead and do this and remember we have been test the volume so See, we can turn the volume down. So we can turn the volume down. We can turn the volume back up. We're gonna get a little bit. As you can see, we're gonna get a little bit more volume out of it, but. Um, It'll boost really loud volume to even a little bit louder, but it's really made for um, headphones. But let's see. So this. So this is the bass boost button. You can turn up to to, to give it more bass. 
Um, you know, it would depend on the song and whether the song has a lot of bass in it or not. But we like this feature because it's a great complement to a very to a good MP4 player. Um, with this, like I said, you can you can throw the MP4 player in your pocket, and then you can basically control the volume from here. Um, you know, uh, and it also is uh, if the MP4 player isn't um, as loud as you would like it to be or as uh, the sound isn't as clean I, you know this will definitely help it out a little bit so uh, just jump online go to www.mp4doggy.com look for the E5 amplifier which we do have on uh, which we do have in stock right now and we do have on sale go ahead and pick one up and um, that's it we're out